What is up everybody? This is Lyle with No Hippie Trucking and Transport Wannabe. Just got done with the 10 hour shift. We're taking a load from Marina, California to somewhere in Minnesota. I forget where we're going, but anyway, that sun came up and you know I was like good to go for another eight or ten, to be honest with you. I had a question come up a while back. Somebody had asked a friend of mine, nobody that was uh, intending on being a truck driver, but just asked about racism and trucking and I really kind of forgot about it till uh, I don't know the day before yesterday anyway something kind of happened that made this come up so as far as uh, racism and trucking goes I've only seen it a couple times and both times it was kind of well the first time I assumed it was being directed at uh, Indian you know from India truck drivers and then the other time, I know it was directed at him. There was an Indian guy out in front of his truck with the prayer rug and the whole deal. And uh, there were some people that said, you know, that's what's fucking wrong with trucking right there or something like that. But what made me think about it was we're at this Del Monte plant in uh, Marina, California. And this Indian dude, man, got out of this... Uh, 389 Peterbilt, it was like orange and cream, had like the orange highlights on the rims, the frame was all stretched out, had a matching trailer and everything, and he gets out of the truck, and he's got a little bit of swagger to him too, got on like the, you know, the the uh, designer jeans, got the shirt on and everything, and then he kind of had a little pimp to his walk too, and as soon as I saw that, I looked at my, you know, my trainer, I'm going to call him a co-driver after all this time even though he makes all the decisions. I was like, this has got to be pissing people off right here because that truck was clean. had the orange highlights on the inside, the little lights and everything. I mean, this is one of the cleanest trucks I've seen. And I was like, you know, I know there's some truckers that are pissed off about this. But it wasn't that, that was a clean, that was clean, wasn't it? That was a nice ass truck. Anyway, as far as racism goes, like I said, I haven't seen any directed at me personally. I've been in a few states or locations in states like, I don't want to talk about the whole state but I've been in a few places where I felt less than welcome but uh, that wasn't by truckers if anything I mean even racist truckers I mean they want to talk so usually uh, you're not going to be seeing that anyway just want to kind of throw that out there uh, about to go home for about I don't know. It's probably going to work out to be about 20 days, I'd imagine. You're going to take a day and a half off or a week and a half off? Yeah, a week and a half. Yeah, so that's going to be uh, about 20 days or so for me. So be looking forward to hooking up some stuff on my barbecue and cooking channel. If you're not subscribed to that channel want to see some cooking videos, stuff like that, just run over and check out No Hippie Barbecue and Cooking. I'm going to leave two videos like right over here. Click on one of those take a look at what's up in the kitchen at my house or on the deck or wherever I happen to be cooking at that time. Anyway, I want to thank you guys for stopping by No Hippie Trucking and Transport. Wannabe, and I'm out.